Hello, welcome to my little video about this wonderful library, uh, the Odyssey Vehicles Collection. Um, yeah, it's it's a phenomenal little library, uh, a great collection of sounds here, um, really, really cool stuff. Um, I just wanted to show you a few little bits and bobs, um, kind of actually abusing the library a bit, maybe not using it exactly in the way that it's intended. Um, but I, yeah, I really love the, the motorcycle sounds. I think they sound awesome. Uh, and I think that they would make, uh, some really quite, uh, brilliant, uh, spaceship sounds, which is something I've been making a lot recently. Um, so I thought what I'd do is if I just grab a couple of these and chuck them in, yep, and see what they sound like. Phenomenal sounds, absolutely phenomenal sounds. Um, here's a little trick that I've been doing a lot um, regarding making making nice spaceships. Um, I take a bit of the sound like this, like that, and like that, so we kind of get a bit of a movement of in and then out again. I'm just going to pitch this up like that. Sounds wonderful. I'm going to add some kind of modulation. I think um, I'd go for a Mondo mod. I'll go for a chopper. I like this one, I think. fun thing we can do here is just automate that just like that and maybe we can get it to rise as it approaches you it's a little extreme let's go like that and then drop to those more extremes at the end like this this is cool but I'm not quite sure if it fits in with the flow of the sound. So I'm going to go like that um, and just bring it back a bit. Let's try that. I really like the little squeaky wheels. Um, that's pretty cool. So let's just print that. So we've got our move. If I just do this, and then this, and then this, and then I can do this, and there it is. Nice. So beginnings of a, a nice um, spaceship sound. Uh, if I now go and throw on a disperser, uh, this makes for a wonderful sound. That sounds awesome there. I wonder, in fact, if we... Um, I'll do that in a minute. Try processing some of the kind of growly bits with it. Um, and then I like to add a Centaurus. Lovely um, chorus plug-in from um, D16 Group Audio. <laughs> Brilliant sound. I'll tell you which one I like is Salina String. Oh, if I can load it. There we go. Oh, no. It loaded. It loaded. Okay. And then print that in. And then there we go. And then we could go atop and add a Doppler. That would be cool. And then we'll just throw in some Doppling settings like this. Uh, unfortunately, I have to record this in mono because of reasons. Um, so I'll bypass the, the panner. Um, see if this works. <laughs> back a bit. I also like to add a bit of 
um, limiting uh, after doppling. Um, I might even also just add a inflator just to kind of get it to pop a bit. Oh, what's happening here? I wasn't very happy there, was it? Let's have a listen to that. And then we have a, a pretty, pretty nice uh, spaceship type sound. Please with that. Um, let us grab some of these growls. There, that's what I was after that. Uh, I'm going to cut that out like that. And um, bring it back over to where we were working. And see what happens if I throw that through um disperser i think it might make for quite an interesting sound so with that oh, yeah interesting um fun thing to do with um just copy and paste not all the things fun thing to do with um <laughs> sorry uh with disperser is to do multiple um really kind of just adds to that that sound um, that sounds pretty nice to me uh, in fact what we could do is uh, just use a little bit of Z noise um, before all of those just clean it just a little bit see nice that's the one Sounds good to me. And then uh, let's just get, no, not transient master. Let's get extreme and go for a multi and maybe see what happens if we do that and then that. Don't like that, but I liked the low end. We're also getting a bit of weird artifacting on the tail. So let's print and then round this sound off with um a nice bit of um well let's just go centaurus run with what you know uh and let's have a listen to that let's find something nice. oh, I like that i like the one we had I've forgotten what it was. Huh. Was it the roads? Ah, oh, I can't remember. Okay, I like that one. Um interested to see just because you know we've already done it once what happens if we try and make this one into a pass by um, with a bit of stuttering well whoops whoopsie whoops whoops like that like that like that oh a little bit odd I wonder if we could I don't like that. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway. That sounds nice. Let's try a bit of dispersor. Sounds nice. Um, I'm on headphones, so I might be misjudging it, but let's try it. I mean, a bit, of, a bit of low end. Hello. No, did I not click on it? Oh, sounds nice to me. Let's see what happens when we print that. Look at that waveform. And then, um, oh yes, there it is. Just 
see what happens if we can get something interesting out of this. Does anyone else get this? You can't select it. It's super annoying. Um, low gain. Off on the pitch. Bypass, bypass. Nice. I like that. Let's try and make it a bit longer. Oh, I like that. Uh, let's make that just slightly longer there. Sounds pretty nice to me. So there, um, take it from the wonderful source of uh, a 1986 Harley Davidson Heritage mot Motorcycle. We have two very nice, tasty, organic sounding uh, spaceship uh, passbys or just general spaceship sounds. <laughs> Um, thank you very much for, uh, for listening and I'll, uh, yeah, see you soon. Bye.